Hi everyone, welcome back to Optives where we talk about eye care, eye health and this month's special team, Loving Your Eyes. Before we begin, I have a big announcement to make. Optives is having a giveaway in celebration of 200 subscribers. Yay, thank you very much. Not really expecting this, but it just came unknowingly. And also in anticipation of World Sight Day. Here are the giveaway items. Um, have a journal with love your eyes on it. Yeah. Love your eyes. A holographic pouch. My favorite. Which is um, a, a glass for tumbler or whatever it's called. So here it is. So the giveaway instructions will be posted on Instagram. Um with my name over here. Or you can check the link in the description box to get the information for the giveaway. I'll also be posting a video on World Side Day, which is the 13th of October, 2022. And this World Side Day is just in celebration of eye health and eye care with this year's theme, love your eyes, hashtag love your eyes. So according to the IAPB, the World Size Day is a campaign to raise awareness about how important eye health is and the need to prioritize your eye health. So check out my shirt, love your eyes. And my roommate also comes to show his off to you guys. So Rumi, why are you? Wow. Okay, so you can see us in our Love Your Eyes t-shirts over here. See mine, this is my roommate. She looks very pretty in her shirt. So here are 10 ways to love your eyes according to the International Agency for the Prevention of Blindness. The first one is to follow the 202020 rule, which I've spoken about in my previous video, the link over here. Or here. So you have to take a break from the screen. Every 20 minutes, take a 20 second break and look at something 20 feet away. This helps to prevent eye strains and headaches. Number two, spend time outside, especially for children. Children should spend at least two hours outside. So this helps their eyes to grow in a healthy way and also prevents the onset of myopia or nearsightedness, according to some studies. Number three, wear sunglasses outside. So you need to wear sunglasses that offer protection against UVA and UVB radiations. These radiations could end up damaging your eyes and the skin around your eyes especially. Number four, is to wear prescription glasses if you need them. If an optometrist has prescribed glasses to you, you need to wear them because this will help improve your vision and also prevent headaches and eye strain. So don't forget to wear your glasses if you have to wear them. Number five, check your cosmetics to avoid infections. So I have a video that was about me applying eye makeup and how to safely apply them. So you can get all the information on that in the link, which is over here or here depending i don't know why it has to be here so just click the link to check out um, the video on that number six is to exercise regularly so exercising regularly can help to prevent lifestyle diseases like hypertension and diabetes and these conditions have effects on the eyes number seven you need to eat a healthy diet you need to eat a diet that contains minerals and vitamins that are necessary to maintain your eye health Number eight, don't smoke. So smoking increases the chances of getting eye conditions like age-related macular degeneration. So the last two is to book an eye test to detect eye problems. And number 10 is to prioritize your eyes. So it's important for us to get an eye test even before we feel like there's anything wrong with our eyes because the doctor or the clinician or the optometrist can see that there's something wrong even before symptoms set in. So it's important for you to get an eye checkup regularly. So you need to prioritize your eye health because you need them for your entire life. This brings us to the end of the video. Don't forget to like this video and share it with someone. And also check out the link in the description to my Instagram space in the giveaway. Also, on World Side Day, we'll be having a free eye screening in front of the Sam Jonah Library at the University of Cape Coast. So come by if you're around in Cape Coast and get your eyes checked. I'll see you guys later. Also, don't forget to get your World Side Day t-shirts. It's super, super important. All right. Goodbye. Love you all. Thank you.